Hello everybody, how you guys been doing and welcome back to our channel One Step. And in today's video, it's on Crunchyroll and it's on how you guys can delete your Crunchyroll account. So I'm just going to be clear with you guys, once you delete your Crunchyroll account, if you guys have like a 5 or 6 month subscription, that is also going to be deleted. And every single history and every single data which is on the Crunchyroll account, that's also going to be deleted which you can't recover ever again. So make sure if you are sure you want to delete Crunchyroll, if you are, then watch this video. And before moving forward, if you guys are new to our channel One Step, then don't forget to hit the like and subscribe to our YouTube channel One Step for future videos like this. And if you guys have any question regarding this video, you can ask us in the comment. Let's move on. First step, you want to go to crunchyroll.com. Once you go to crunchyroll.com, you have to log in into your account. Once you log in into your account, you're going to come to Crunchyroll just like this. I've logged in into my account. That's why it's showing me this little profile picture over here. Once you log in into Crunchyroll by coming over here, what you want to do is open another tab and on another tab you want to write crunchyroll.com slash nuke. Once you search for crunchyroll.com slash nuke, it's going to take you to the deactivation page. And over here, it's going to ask you why you want to deactivate your account. You have to choose an uh, option from over here. And if you don't want to choose any option, you can click on others and you can just explain why. So I'm going to write and once you write this so you don't have to write this you can write any other reason so let me just write a nice reason all right this just looks like an excuse so i'm gonna write i don't like it anymore i'm gonna write this and i'm gonna enter the password of my crunchyroll account over here after i enter the password of my account and click on deactivate account basically my account will be deactivated so yeah that's basically how you guys can delete your crunchyroll account and remember, just like in other case, this deactivation is not like a normal deactivation. It also warns you once you deactivate, you can't undo it. Only do it if you're sure. All right. So this deactivation means your account will be deleted. Not like Facebook deactivation, which you can reactivate after one or two days. All right. Once you do it, it's gone. So make sure you really want to do it and then only click this button. But after that, if you really want to, then just enter your passport, enter a reason, deactivate, and it will be done. So yeah, that's how we guys can do it. So if you guys found our video helpful, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe to our channel. One to step. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.